Hello, my pretties! Welcome back! I'm the Game Beaver, and this is another episode of Jurassic World The Game, where today we are talking about the two new leaks. Well, not leaks. Well, they're not leaks, god damn it, they're just updates. Uh, it seems like Ludia, or the creators of this game, are releasing a new update soon. And this is including two new uh, hybrids. <gasps> are they herbivores? Are they carnivores? Are they maybe pteranodons, which we could really go for, or... Or herbivores that we could really go for? No. No. Do you know what they are? They're blooming carnivores again. <laughs> or at least they look like it. Yes, we have a one on the left and one on the right. We have on the right, definitely Ichthyostegosaurus or Ichthyosaurus, I think it was. I think they actually called it Ichthyosaurus, but that's already a thing. So if Echo the Dolphin ever does come to uh, the game, well, it's going to have to be called something else. Uh, but this is uh, a mix between rage and um, Ichthyostega, if you didn't know. So that's probably going to make a legendary hybrid. So it's it's basic. It could be as good as Indominus, but I'm not going to say it's going to be because Indominus is a T-Rex and a Raptor. And T-Rex was pretty much the best carnival. And Raptor was the best carnival of a super rare. With this Ichthyosaurus, Ichthyostega is the second best because you've got, uh, if we just look at our dinosaur list, let's go into here. As far as legendary amphibians go, Sarkasuchus just beats it. But it depends really what you want, more attack or more health. In fact, actually, yeah, Sarkasuchus, Sark yeah, Sarkasuchus beats it in both uh, aspects of that. Um, now, the rage, I don't know, because we've got the raptor there. Raptor's 800 health, 306 attack. Now, where the hell is Rage? It shouldn't be too hard to spot. There it is. So, 881 attack. So, 81 extra attack. But 25 less... Sorry, 81 extra health, 25 less attack. So, to be honest... Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if this thing is as good as Indominus Rex. But, this is the question, do we need another Indominus Rex? And the answer is no, <laughs> we don't need another Indominus Rex. Um, I have like so many rages, I've got enough to make a level 40, so we could definitely get a level 20, that's for sure. We've got plenty of DNA, 300,000, uh, 15,000 VIP points, um, so that isn't an issue. Now, the other hybrid has come under some... So, some, some people have theorized. I was going to say, it's come under fire! Get down! But no, it, it hasn't. It's just a regular... It seems to be another carnivore. Now, its mouth is really short and quite dumpy, or at least the uh, outline of it is. And hold on a second. Oh, that's good. Okay. Woo! <laughs> anyway. Um, it looks like it is a herbivore-carnivore hybrid. Uh, Ludia has still not put in... Um, a mixed dinosaur, so you don't get one that's half herbivore, half carnivore. Which would be really good, I think, because then it would really switch things up, and you've got to think, like, you know, if it's a herbivore and a carnivore, it's going to be weak to carnivores, normally. It's going to be weak to, um, amphibians. But... It's going to have a resistance to herbivores, and it's going to have a resistance to flyers. So, either it's always going to be weak against something, and, always, and in the other case, it's going to be... It's either going to be weak, or it's going to be strong. And I think that's a really cool idea. Nothing's ever normal. So you look at its, its attack, and it's either going to be halved or doubled. What? Is it doubled? It's... No, it's 50% extra, isn't it? It's either 50% off or 50% added on. I think that would be awesome. So the first... If we look at this image... It has to be Superosaurus. Because of the spikes, they're really thin. Fairly evenly spaced apart, exactly like Superosauruses are. And the horn on the head is a dead, dead giveaway. Now, if we look at the structure of the head of the, um, of the new hybrid, it looks quite flat. Now, we have a lot of carnivores to choose from. Because it's obviously going to be a carnivore. Don't even look at the hand. It has two fingers. But if you know anything about this game, any uh, dinosaur that copies the T-Rex animation, as in a big carnivore like this, always has two hands. But, oh my god, I'm getting my phone buzzing like crazy. 
Uh, okay. Uh, that was nothing. Great. Yes. <laughs> so, we can narrow it down to dinosaurs with this animation. The same goes for Ichthyostega, but actually, the Ichthyosaurus has different hands, which is awesome, because they've actually put in some effort to give it webbed feet and webbed, um, fingers. And the thing about the Ichthyosaurus, before I leave it for good, Ichthyosaurus was leaked a while ago. Um, so we already know what it's going to be like. Um, I made a video on it. I quickly took it down because I didn't think it was fair um, to have it up because, you know, I, I in, in the, at, at the end of the day, um, I, sorry, I have to kill myself every time I say that because it's so cringy. If you watch Jeremy Kyle, at the end of the day, right, I don't care. I love him. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I support the creators because I support, I like this game. I do. Some people call it money grabbing. Some cases are. But apart from the recent introduction to VIP, you could get everything in game as long as you earn it. And then VIP came along and it was like, no, you've got to pay for these dinosaurs now, which kind of does suck, but you never know. Maybe we'll have a, a coupon day or something. <laughs> oh God, that's actually a real thing. Yeah, I can see that happening. Wow, that actually came to pass, didn't it? Slap it on a plastic lunchbox and sell it. And they did, and they made a lot of money. Uh, I bet. Um, so, moving on to this super something. Whatever it is, I hope it has super in the name. Um, so, let's narrow it down, shall we, to the carnivores that it could be. Now, it, it might be Carnotaurus, but we've already got Carnoraptor. So, it would be strange to have another one. And so far, we do not have, we do not have a dinosaur or creature that has two hybrids to be made out of it that I know, that I, that I know off the top of my head, anyway. Um, it could be a Giga. In fact, actually, I think Giga has a hybrid. That's why I don't have a level 40, and that would make sense. Um, now, let's have a look. We, Rage? Well, Rage is already that one. Now, what I think is the candidate for this is the Allosaurus. Now, this is because of the head. The head, to me, is a really big giveaway. It's sort of, if you look so closely to its top of its crest, below the horn, it, ju it just looks like it. It looks like, if you, hold on, let's see if we can um, zoom in to Allosaurus as closely as we can. Look at that, it's, it's got like a right angle at the top of it, very arched, pronounced curves above its eyes. Now that looks like that. Uh, other people have, um, it looks like the image. Other people have suggested that it's possible it could be Tyrannotitan. I would also, I, I could agree with this, and I might be um, up to eating my own hat, actually, after saying this. But I think it's its mouth and its jaw, its whole head is too narrow to be that head that we, we see. Um, so I think it's Allosaur. Allosaur's got more of a short snout. Tyrannotitan is a lot longer. Uh, if you just compare them, not that I can really go to them really quick. There, if you, if you see quick, in fact, we can put side by side sort of images, can't we? Um, if I do that, and then I do this, and then you can sort of see, Alasaur's a lot um, bulkier build, a lot heavy set, not as narrow, and I think that's what this is going to be. So, we could be having our first ever super Allosaurus, or super sort. Supalosaurus. Supalosaurus. That would be amazing. Soup. Uh, soupy. Also, I love. I love the colors on this. Look at those eyes. They're green. Allosaur, I don't look at you enough. You are gorgeous, my friend. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, and so those are the two, two new hybrids. Now, as far as updates go, I have been trying my best to get as many coins as possible. Um, I also have been trying to do the mission that I have right now. And, oh my god, my dog's barking. Oh, whoa, whoa, he doesn't like the mission. He's like, no, don't. Don't collect the coin. No. Um, my mission is basically collect 100,000 coin from the towers. Um, you could do it, right? If you bought 20, 30, 40 towers, because they're really cheap, um, you put them all around a few John Hammonds. You could probably rattle that off in an hour, because every five minutes they've collected their 100 coins. And depending on how many percentage boosts you've got on them, then they could even gain 200, so double, if you do it correctly. In fact, I'm pretty sure you could get probably about maybe 500 coins from it easy. Uh, we are, I think, and I have been doing it this every time I, um, I click on this. And 
that is just collecting them all. And I've just had a thought to go through my my head. It's one of my friend's birthday soon, and I I haven't got him um, something that I was gonna get him. Oh dear. <laughs> but we we're getting there slowly. We're on sixty thousand almost, and so that's over halfway. Now about the oh we, oh we've got stuff here. So let's collect this DNA. We're also gonna do the stampede because for the first time in a long time, the stampede is incredibly easy. Um, we've also got this. This is another 200. No, it's got to be more than 200. It's like 300, right? 192. Yeah, it's 300. Okay. And get all of yours. Lovely jubbly. And there we go. 45 million. And I still haven't collected all these. I don't think it's going to be a big update. They haven't. But I don't know. It seems a bit weird for them to update this close to sort of Christmas time because usually they update at about Christmas time and it's Halloween time um so I don't know I do hope if we look at the hybrid images that this Ichthyostega uh, Rajasaur hybrid creature has different animation I really d I hope it does because it's a little bit lower to the ground um than the Allosaur Supersaurus hybrid that I'm guessing we're gonna get. That would be really nice to see um, just a new set of animations. And the thing is, yes, eventually it's gonna be copied to death like Gatorade was. Now we've got three other, well, three creatures in total that have that animation. So this is the stampede, don't die. Sorry, dino preservation, that's it, don't die. Um, so clearly we want to use something that can kill them in one hit. I'm thinking Indominus! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. Don't die. Well, I tell you what, it's a lot harder for them than it is for me! <laughs> so that's a quick super rare pack. Um, I think people were thinking maybe these new hybrids would be a VIP exclusive. Um, I'm hoping they're not because, for one, that would be stupid. Like, what? How could you hybridize and then have them locked behind VIP because you have to have the dinosaurs first unless they were VIP creatures, which I don't think any of these are. Um, maybe that'll come eventually, but can you imagine how long it would take to get a VIP hybrid? First, you have to get it to level um, 40, so you have to get eight of the buggers. Oh, and then you have to get another eight of the buggers of something else. So that hybrid, Jesus. It's gonna be one crazy hybrid. And then at that point, can you imagine? Indominus, poor little Indominus will be pathetic in comparison, and so will pretty much everything else. So that is a raptor as well as the uh, 325 VIP points. We have a VIP only event, and wow, look at that! Pretty good opponents. Um, Pecky eyes, and then uh, Super Kool Aid, and then we could do Clown Raptor. I think that's pretty easy matchup. We could do that. So I'm pretty hyped. For this update, I really hope there's more than just two hybrids. Somebody made a fake, like, <gasps> look what's coming, and they were like fake other dinosaurs. It was like a Shunosaur hybrid and a Therizinosaurus hybrid, um, which would have been really cool to get, but I, it, it was so obviously fake, but it was awesome to see anyway. It's always nice to see the fans getting involved and doing other things like I do. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, we've definitely won this. I won the aquatic hybrids already. I'm saving up my DNA for it. Uh, oh, that's right. Yeah, guys, sorry, I forgot. Yeah, let's get the other hybrid. Um, I did... Oh, wow. We really didn't need Super Kool-Aid, did we? Uh, normal Sarkasukas could have done this. Damn. Damn. Well, we do have Ostoposaurus in case things get a little bit hairy. <gasps> oh, no, Becky! No! And Kool-Aid's going to kill you with three hits, I think. One, two, three. And one, two, three, four. And a block. I was hoping it didn't block that, but either way, we've won this no matter what, because so that Carnoraptor comes in. And this is the thing, right? If it's Supersaurus and Allosaurus, meaning a super rare and a rare, it's probably going to be a rare. Um, Carnoraptor. No, it might be a super rare. They usually do that, don't they? If it's, like, a legendary, then it becomes a legendary. If there's one legendary, it's a legendary. If there's one super rare, it's a super rare. Like, whatever the highest is that you hybridize it with, that's what it'll become. So... But then Spinoraptor is a super rare, and Conoraptor's rare, but they're basically the same. So it's gonna be really interesting to see how they balance that out uh, with these new creatures, or the new hybrids. Um, 
Yeah, sorry, my bad. I was gonna get the uh, new hybrid. Oh, it's not really new. It's a hybrid that I haven't. I think it's Alangosaurus and Majungasaurus. So Majung, you've got yourself a hybrid, babe. Oh, <gasps> I forgot. Oh, thank God. You know, 46 bucks, I'm okay with. I'm at a point where I can spend bucks now. Look how green you are. The incredible bulk. Well, actually, no, you'd be purple if you were that, wouldn't you? So, Majunga Sauce. I'm pretty sure it's Majung and Allah. Allah. Yeah, there it is, 100. At this point, I don't need a carnival hybrid. Even if it is a common and it's pretty rubbish. I, I've i got Indominus Rex. I've got all, the, all of the legendary um, creatures, carnivores anyway. All the super rares. So, this common hybrid isn't really going to help me much. That's for sure. Oh, bless him. Let's put him in the hybrid park. There you go. You'll get some path to... You know what it is? I love this place, but... It's just bare. It's bland. I need more things in it. It's just path and cages. So here it is. Let's level you, buddy. And see what you're like at level 10. Uh, 218 and 102 attack. So yeah, for a common, that's, that's pretty much max for a common. So he's probably going to be on par with a super rare when level 40. Again, not really useful to me. But that's a lank we're taking out. We've got another... See, we've got level 40 Majung, so it's as if we didn't lose anything, really. And a Lanqua. <gasps> no! A Lanqua is gone! I need to make a level 40 again. But that's okay. That's not too bad. Let's go back in here. Hell no, am I not um, using a Langosaurus uh, in this? <laughs> It'll die. My bad. Had to close the window. Don't want these weirdo freaks outside hearing me. <laughs> so we're going to have to use T-Rex. Um, probably our best flyer here. And then a good amphibian. I think. I hope. Sarko. So I'm going to go for the uh, reserve on the T-Rex. I probably should have went for a block. Because he's probably going to switch. Oh, it doesn't. Can we kill it in two? I think we have to go for three. Um, one, two. Ah, oh, 200 off. Well, you know, we killed it. That's good. We're going to die in one hit, which means he's going to have two. He's going to go for one attack and a possible one block. Um, I'm pretty sure Skeletor is a... Uh, not Skeletor. It's not Skeletor. It's a dragon. Oh, went for full on two. Okay, it's got nothing. We can go for two attack on one reserve. And there you go. We won. Jeepers. That was easy. I didn't need to go for one. Sometimes I don't get the box. They must just be programmed either easy or hard. So he can kill, he can kill me. He can go for full on three. Doesn't do it. You know what? Sarko's not even going to get a look in. Not even going to... Oh, maybe it is. <laughs> yeah, we're dead. He's going to go for two. Three, three, three. Doesn't go for anything. Come on, kill it. Oh, full on block. This Indominus does not want to go down. Oh, look, we got the flying animation, except we're not in the air. Oh, and there's the three. Takes out the dragon. Now, that's a bit annoying because we've lost... Well, as soon as we use that anyway, we've lost our best flyer. And we've got two more battles to do. Oh, Sarko goes red. Belly flop. Bam. Your Indominus Rex is paralyzed. It cannot move. Snap. Call it snappy. That's what we should have called it. Uh, yeah, we still got three. Ah, uh, now we're starting to get on. Look at that leper mastodonosaurus. Looking beautiful. So now we need, basically, we need one of those, which could lure in the mastodonosaurus. And then we need a good um, amphibian, which is going to have to be Ostopasaurus. I'm going to go for the reserve. Because I'm pretty sure mastodonosaurus can't kill us in two. And Carnoraptor definitely can't. Uh, we can kill it now. I am very tempted. You know, I'm gonna go for it. We're gonna kill him. Awesome. Okay. Brings in Pritrodon. Uh, can't kill us in one. We'll have to go for two. Does go for two. Okay. Right, now. Uh, at this point, we can go for three reserve. We're okay. If he goes for two, we're dead. Goes for three, we're dead. He goes for three, that's good. Because now we can kill him in two. Almost one, in fact. 
Imagine a level 40 of this, that'd be nuts. So, one, two, and then... You know what, one for good measure, just in case he can kill me in two. I don't think he will be able to. Ooh, he'd be about 2,300 attack, maybe 2,400 if he hit me for two. Ah, oh, perfect! Okay, so we've got two more fights to do. We've lost Ostopsaurus, we've lost Super Kool-Aid, we've lost the dragon. It's not looking good. And you're dead. So that's another 50. Last, ooh, second last one. Um, ah, you see, this is what I mean. We need, uh, scab eyes, we need berries. Then we need something to take out them. Like Pritrodon. Well, I'll tell you what, Megalosaurus and Pritrodon. Um, what about just a good, like you? Oh my god, if we win this, I'll be amazed. And Pritrodon. Go on, go on, go on! See what you can do. If you swap now, I'll be annoyed, because you've never swapped before. Aha! Right, I, I went for a block there, because I thought you may be able to kill me. I'm gonna go for another two. Hopefully he will attack for two. Oh yeah, we've killed it! <laughs> awesome. One, two, you're dead. Berries, berries! Awesome, awesome. Okay, Indominus can come in and kill us in one. Hopefully it goes for full on three. If it does, that would be amazing. Come on, hit me for three. Come on. No! <laughs> Just one, okay, fine, whatever. Okay, Ichthyo Stega now. He's probably gone for loads of block. I'm gonna have to do that. Yeah, there it is. So he's gonna have four. Now, if he goes for three, I mean, no matter what he does, I'm not dead. Aha! See, if I'd only went for two block, I would have been dead. That's why I went for three. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, no! Okay, well, I think we've won anyway. I've only got Megalosaurus, Ankylodocus, and Antarctica Pelta as my best now. Two herbivores and a carnivore. We're going to be facing up against them. We're going to be facing up against carnivores and amphibians. And we don't have anything to counter the amphibians. One, two, three kills it. And one, two. See, even with all that health, if it faces a carnivore that's really good at this standard, it just can't do anything. It needs double the health. <laughs> I'll make it nuts. And the final battle! I knew it would all be friggin... Oh. Okay, well... We've seen what they do. We've seen what they do. Um, I think... I think that that actually could win it. As long as they don't switch. I think we've done this. Oh, now you switch! Oh! Come on! You can't do that! You can't just change the rules! All the time it doesn't switch and now it's like, yeah, you know what? I'm not gonna let you beat me with the ankle of Docus. <laughs> Does not want to fight me, okay. Um... Ah. What's, th what's the best I can do here? Three block? He's just going all out every time I have to keep blocking. Oh no! Okay, you know what? You know what? Four reserve. Let's do it. Okay, he's got like six. He can kill me. Oh, five. Meh, kind of went for full on block. Oh, and he goes for one. That's good. That's good. You know, it might be worth keeping Peggy Eyes is alive. So I'm going to do that. Right. Um. Eee, please. Oh, yes, we killed him. Okay. Oh, we went for way too much, actually. We overexerted. He has to go for three to win. Oh, that is not good. That is not good. Oh, he doesn't attack? What? What? Only had one. Seven block. Oh, God. I'm not complaining. I'm not going to complain. That's awesome. Woo. Did I pay for an easier bot? Is that what the VIP is? 
So one, two, three kills him, and four reserve, one block, because he didn't have anything else. And even if Ostavosaurus goes for two and only has two block, Anglodocus can kill it. So this whole VIP event I did do within one sitting, but I also um, used all my dinosaurs, so I'm happy with that. That's okay, because for the longest time there's been nothing happening in the game at all, because we're waiting for the um, American events to end, because they've been going for quite a while, and I was like, how come there's no events for the past two days? But it's because they're going, and there was like four or five events, which was really good. I just seem to finish them all really quickly. And there it is, the legendary pack! Oh, yes, DNA! And a microsaurus, which eh, is okay. Over 70,000 DNA, and the battle stage infinite. I'm not gonna do for a uh, mystery pack, because it's pretty crap. And that, my friends, is that. Uh, what should we put in? Um, when am I next gonna check this? Probably tomorrow, so I'll put in a raptor. Um, and then we need something to hybrid with. Well, not hybrid, just uh, get up. Oh, you see, look! The uh, towers are done. And if you play that game a lot, you're gonna see a, that happen quite often. Um, it was Alanqua, wasn't it? Alanqua's my next one. Because I've just sold them, so we'll put you in. You only take four minutes, so I'm, I might as well leave you on. Um, and I just get that. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, guys. If you're excited for the update, leave a like. Head has no relevance to the game whatsoever, but it really helps me out. <laughs> and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Because boy, oh boy, do you look pretty today. Mm -hmm. <laughs>